Hi, I'm Jacob and I'm from Aurora Middle School. Today we're going to do hand, between hands on equations. And we are going to be using pawns and cubes. So the yellow pawns are going to equal negatives and the black pawns are going to equal positives. Pretty much the exact same thing with the greens, but they're going to, those two are going to equal negatives. Those two are going to equal positives. So our first equation is 3x. 3x plus 2, okay. negative 3x plus 2 equals negative 10, negative 10x. So what you want to do is you want to add, you can add pawns on, they have to be the same color to keep the balance. So you want to add two white uh, negatives to each side, this would equal a pair, equal a pair of zero, a white and a black. So you and then you can add cubes on too. So it's pretty much the exact same thing. If you have a negative and a positive on this side, you can uh, count it as a, as a zero. So what you want to do is you want to put on a positive. T I mean two negative twos onto each side. So you have to keep the balance. So you can take away a red and a green. And four negative four times negative. I mean negative four times what equals negative twelve. The answer would be 3 for that equation. Now we're going to do another equation. So we're going to do a positive. No, you're going to do 5 plus x plus negative 3x. So what you're going to want to do for this one is take out 2 and, that, and since these are the exact same color, you can only do it with positive numbers, not negative. So if there's like, imagine you have a white right here, you can't take off these two. But you can only take off the positives, so you can take off those two. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to, take, you're going to, want to put five, negative 5's on each side to keep the balance. You're going to take that off. Negative 3 times what equals negative 6? Negative 3 times negative 3 equals negative 6.